uh, with with this tweet I saw about the finish in the women's hundred pre classic, where someone's questioning if the photo finish got it right because it reminded me of your Marcel Jacobs Christian Coleman World Indoors analysis, where you looked at the photo finish and enhanced it and thought that you were going to be able to see the difference between one one hundredth of a second. So I think your thought process is spreading throughout the globe, Gordon. In this case, people are thinking Shrika Jackson finished ahead of Shakira Richardson. So you're you're partly, I think, responsible for the – actually, I'm sure people before you did the over-analysis of photo finishes, but you certainly have had I mean, a part in its history. Let's hear out Mr. D.P.O.S. Smith. What's, what's his position? So it says, yep. athletes shall be placed in order in which any part of their bodies, i.e. torso, as distinguished from the head, neck, arms, legs, hands, or feet, reaches the vertical plane of the near edge of the finish line as defined above. So he's basically quoting the track rule, and then underneath is the photo finish, and then he says, what am I missing? And All right, let's zoom. We're throwing up the picture there. Yeah, you see the, the zoom angle, and from that angle, it does look like Jackson is in front. But the problem is Richardson is being obstructed because the photo is being shot from that side. And what he's missing is there's a photo from the other side, which also comes into play. And TJ Vizel, track and field sprint expert, says official timer uses two photos on each side of the finish line. We are missing the opposite picture to see the torso of second place. Are we just destined to have this every single time there's a close finish, Gordon? Is this our future? I think so. But when I do look at that photo, uh -oh. it does look Conspiracy like Sharika Jackson won. It does look like Sharika Jackson beat Shakira Richardson in that photo. So, But there's another photo. That's the whole point. There's another photo. There's another angle that you're not seeing. Yeah, but this angle looks pretty convincing. Doesn't it? Because you, because you literally can't see. It's literally blocking the other runner in question. That's why it looks convincing. A hundred. I mean, I weren't know. they? They both. It was ten nine two for both of them, right? Yeah, I think I'm. So, so it went to the hundred. So again, like I said, after your Coleman Jacobs analysis, it's very hard to separate that small a distance. Now you look at the photo. You see Elaine Thompson her all way out there. That's easy to figure out. That's clear as day. But when you're talking about one one hundredth, the margin is not going to be that big. So to pull it apart from this is going to be difficult. This just reminds me of like we are in the to we're in the screenshot era of sports, right? Every foul now in the NBA is a dirty play because someone gets a screenshot and it makes the defender's actions look incredibly nefarious. Which like you just slow it down. It's like, well, hold on. They were just playing basketball and limbs were flying around and an arm hit this part. It, it, you're adding way too much context. Uh, or you need to add more context and it's there. Photo finishes. I mean, I guess you could say it's the original screenshot. This predates even us arguing about it on, on Twitter. So it's not surprising to me that we have come to this point. But yeah, both timed at 1092. I'm, I'm confident that they got it right. You are confident? I mean, yes, I, I believed in, in Jacobs over Coleman. I believe Richardson over Jackson. Okay, but let me ask you this question. Do you think timers get it right 100% of the time? Well, sometimes they do need to make judgment calls, right? That's the whole idea when it gets, when it gets that close. Yeah. So you didn't, no, you didn't yeah. answer the question, right? You no, no, yeah, 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 yeah. Th th there's obviously going to be human error okay. at, at some point. There's going to be human error, but I'm saying picking one photo from one, I would need to see the other photo, right? But you never that other photo usually never gets released. You always see it from this angle, not that angle. I mean, watching in real time, didn't you think she got second? I thought she got. I thought they got it right. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, I why know don't that's, they that's hard to see. Why, why don't they release the second photo? Here it is, 10.913 to 10.914. That's what it was. So, 0.001.
second. Spreads is going to be close. I don't know. I think maybe they made a mistake. It could have happened. I'm not willing to count out human error. I just think it's interesting that we just assume automatic timing, a computer is doing the job for us. But, you know, at the end of the day, it requires two eyes to make a decision based on what the computer told them. So mm-hmm. there could be there could have been a mistake at the world champs. There could have been a mistake here at Pre. I do think there mm-hmm. was a mistake at the twenty sixteen Penn Relays Drew Hunter DMR, but no one's <laughs> talking about that. Go Gordon, watch the, the tape. Here. Drew Hunter did not play win the, the race. Now. It was Jack Salisbury. Um but uh I don't know. Yeah, I mean we have to take I mean it's they're the refs, right? And you may think the foot was on the line or the foot was yeah. on the line. There was a foul or not a foul. At the end of the day, we have to have some sort of consistency, and that consistency is a timer who is certified, who we just mm-hmm. be trust. Is that the word? Be trust? And trust. You say trust. And trust, and yeah. We just trust. Simply trust. Yeah. That we trust. That's all you got to do. Get, to get it right. Um, so... Shakari won this round. Maybe he'll go the other way in it, two months. Well, with Jacobs and Coleman, it mattered because a gold medal was at stake. This ultimately does not really matter. Those two are pretty even. Yeah. And whether or not one of them ran 10.913 and one of them ran 10.914 or they flipped it, we're in the same situation that we're in. Yeah. The season will not be defined by the pre-classic 100 who got second and third. I feel confident in that. The more confident. We'll see. I don't know. It could be the thing. It could be the domino. All right, we had Ostrava yesterday, which took place right 